Springfield residents are continuing with their weekly routines today, but say the shooting came as a surprise. KEZI 9 News reporter Chinu Her talked to residents. He joins us live in Springfield with their reactions to the shooting. Chinu. Yeah, neighbors that live near this Walmart on Olympic Street said that they shop here regularly and a shooting is the last thing that they expected to happen. Although it was a scare, they're happy and relieved at how fast police handled the situation. It's only, I think, two blocks away. Barbara Bradley says her Springfield neighborhood is generally quiet and safe. A mother of four boys, she was shocked when she heard of the shooting outside of Walmart. To hear that something like that even happened over there, I, I was shocked because when you go to Walmart, that's what you see is families and little kids doing their school supply shopping. And, and she's not alone. Michelle Paquette also lives in Springfield and is a regular at Walmart. She witnessed the shooting on Saturday with her children. I come here all the time and I always am walking between Jerry's and Walmart. It's a little freaked out. Yeah, it's upsetting. Police say, unfortunately, situations like this happen often, especially with the drug problem in the area being higher than average. But they want the public to know they take the community safety very seriously. People got to know the police here at Springfield are going to come after you if you do stuff like this, either whether you sell drugs or whether you use drugs or you're doing robberies. We're going to come after you. you know. As shocked and unsettled as both women were, they agreed that police handled the situation well. That helped ease their concerns. Yeah, yeah it was seconds. Um, like I said, maybe 60. That was fast. I'm really proud of our police department and the K-9 units. It makes me feel really good that they are there that fast to respond. Yeah, Bradley says her kids are active in her neighborhood, so she is happy at how fast police responded to the situation. Springfield Police says it took them about 40 minutes to locate the suspect's car and block off the neighborhood. And almost immediately, they caught the first suspect, and about an hour later, the second. Live in Springfield, she knew her, KZI 9 News.